Hey guys, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Tracy. If you're new here, I make a lot of fitness and lifestyle content. Judging by the title of this video, it's going to be a try on haul today for Paragon Fitwear's newest collection, Breeze slash Featherknit. I am so friggin' stoked about this collection. Y'all have no idea. The shorts that are in this collection have to be some of my top five favorite shorts of all time and that's saying a lot but we'll talk that later let's talk logistics of this launch the Feathernet slash breeze collection is going to be launching on august 2nd at 4 p.m central time you can sign up for early access to shop at 3 p.m central time and i'll leave that description down below but as always code tracy saves you 10 percent off and you can always shoot over your confirmation email to this email right here to enter into my monthly giveaway to win a 50 dollars gift card to an active wear brand of your choice so that was a lot. I'm gonna go ahead and put sizing right up here for you guys. I wear a size extra small for all bottoms, all smalls for the tops, and that should be it. So I'll put all the colors that are launching over here, but there are a couple of different fabrics that are launching in this collection. The first one we all know and love is the Naked Fabric from Paragon Fitwear. So it is made with water bottles and recycled materials produced ethically, and we love that. So it is Basically, Paragon Fitwear is like bread and butter, literally butter, because it's so soft to the touch. It's this double brushed material that's very thin, so it literally feels like you're wearing nothing. It's literally naked fabric. And if you guys watched my top five leggings video, I put the naked leggings from Paragon Fitwear as one of those top five for the leggings that I wear the most to go run errands, do anything around the house, to lounge in especially. I don't really wear those to work out at all because I feel like it wouldn't be as sweat wicking because it is a double brushed, very thin material. So everything outside of the gym though, the naked fabric is gonna be your best freaking friend. We have a performance fabric, which is Featherknit. It's their newest performance fabric. It's so soft and silky, very, very lightweight. So I just know that it's going to be my favorite short to wear during days like this, where it's just so freaking hot outside, so humid. I'm definitely going to be sweating a bunch. And so having a performance fabric to really be sweat wicking is important to me. And for something to be lightweight as well, so that way I'm not dying in it. Feathernet is going to be your best friend for that. All in all, very excited to show these pieces off to you guys. And let's just jump in to talk about the pieces. Like I just be talking so much like... First and foremost, the high rise naked pocket short. You guys, I've been begging Paragon Footwear to come out with some freaking naked shorts and here they are. So this is gonna be a five inch short, which is perfect because it's gonna sit at the thickest part of your thigh. Anything shorter for me personally is gonna roll up right up and it's just not the move. It's gonna look like underwear. It's gonna look like you're wearing panties. Okay, period panties. And we don't want that. Whenever I wear leggings or shorts, I do like to pull it at my booty crack. I'm not gonna lie. I think it looks super flattering with the naked fabric because it's so soft. There is a tendency for the seam to like come out. And even though it separates your cheeks, it doesn't sit right in there the whole time. So the biggest thing about these shorts that Paragon Fitwear is launching is now they implemented sculpt seam. And basically what sculpt seam is, is that Paragon Fitwear added a little elastic seam on the inside of the shorts. So that way the seam sits inside your glutes the entire time and you never have to worry about it coming out or anything, which it sat in there all right. Like, it sat in there just fine. It features this double lined waistband with no seam at the top. So they're just very, very soft and very stretchy. Again, I'm wearing a size extra small for all of the bottoms. The seam at the bottom, it kind of just holds you in. There's still a lot of stretch to them. So I don't think that they just make my legs look like sausages or anything, but I feel like whenever I squat, yeah, see, it just kind of holds its shape and it does not ride up or roll up whatsoever, which I love. And it does feature that side pocket and let's just test out this is an iphone 11 pro max just kind of like slides in there perfectly so there you have it these are squat proof but because they're so thin i would only wear thongs with my leggings anyway i wouldn't actually wear any like cheeky underwear or anything like that that would show through but i think that we should be just fine on the squat proof department but overall, definitely one of my top picks in this collection. I've already worn these shorts this week to train my clients in and it was just so comfortable. So definitely top pick for sure. Next up, I'm not gonna make you guys wait. I will talk about the feather knit shorts next. These have to be one of my top favorite shorts of all time. So again, it features the new feather knit material, which is a very soft, silky performance based material that's very lightweight so it feels very feathery to the touch it's just very cooling whenever you touch it as well so this short is a scalloped hem type short which means that on the side here 
the seams kind of like scoop upwards. They do fit very, very true to size. So I would say that if you're wanting a more loose fit, then size up if you're in between, but otherwise very, very true to size. There is also a short on the inside with a pocket, which I love. So that way, whenever I'm on walks or runs with the dogs and I can just kind of put my keys in here or my phone in here. So overall, the entire short itself is going to be made of that feather knit material. And then there's a very little Paragon Fitwear logo on the side. If you just see the movement of these shorts, they're just so flowy and lightweight. And I just love how these feel so much. And I also like how the waistband isn't too thick either because my torso is just very, very short. So I feel like if I wore shorts or leggings that were way too high waisted, I would either have to roll them down or I just kind of look like a tree stump. And we don't want that. So I love the waistband on these and just kind of where it hits me. But let's just go ahead and try these on. There's a little detail about these shorts that I didn't mention, but it does have, I think this is called a heat press seam, if that's how you can describe that. But I just love whenever activewear companies do this type of seam because it has a very clean look to it. Whenever you turn to the side, you actually can't really see the inner short lining because it is very, very short. It kind of like cuts my glutes off low key. But let's go ahead and try to fit my phone in that side pocket. Okay, so it doesn't fit all the way, but I still do feel like they are very secure. So if I were to run around and whatnot, it wouldn't fall out or be at risk of falling out at all. There's that little tie where you can just kind of like cinch it in and tie it and whatnot, but I feel like I don't really need that. The band is stretchy already and it just fits me completely true to size. Overall, I freaking love these shorts. Definitely covers your glutes, but there's one thing I will say about these shorts because the inner short lining is a little bit on the shorter side. I feel like the short lining might show a little bit because the shorts are just so thin. I will be wearing the short all freaking summer. This is my top pick for sure like hands down on the topic of feather knit materials this is the feather knit flight bra so again made of the same material as the shorts so in a bra form with a little cute like v in the middle but it doesn't show the girls at all okay it's just kind of a cute little detail overall very basic it has this little elastic at the bottom of the bra to hold the girls up and then the back is just a racer back detail nothing too crazy at all and then you have the paragon logo right up here but again, this is very, very silky soft, smooth to the touch. And I feel like I can definitely wear this to the gym and be just fine because it is a performancey material. But instead of feeling very slinky or shiny and whatnot, it just feels very soft and silky. I literally do not know another way to describe this other than it just feels very silky soft and lightweight. It just kind of covers everything very nicely and I feel very secure. I would definitely say that this bra is a medium to high impact sports bra. I would definitely wear this for a hit or high intensity type of workout. So feel very comfortable that nothing is going to fall out. I wear a 32D sports bra and a small fits me completely fine. I don't feel like I need to size up or down. Love this freaking bra. Next up is the naked high neck racer back bra. So it does look very similar to the feather knit flight bra, but this does not have like the V in the middle and it actually scoops very low on the sides. There isn't any risk of side boob coming out at all. Heads up that it's a very narrow cut, but I actually do love wearing this top just out. I feel like it's long enough to be considered a long line bra because my boobs kind of end like right here and there's still about an inch or two of space down here and there's also an elastic band. So I still feel very secure, definitely a medium to high support sports bra on me, has removable cup pads. All the bras have removable cup pads, but the back of this bra is a true racer back bra with like the thin straps and whatnot. So very, very airy, very brushed as well, and also true to size. Alrighty guys, this is the Naked Tank bra. It's restocking in black along with the new colors as well. And this is just a staple in my closet. I don't wear bras with underwires anymore. I just wear my sports bras as actual bras whenever I go out. And this is definitely one of those bras that I stay wearing out. I just love the fit and the feel of it. It's just so comfortable. Again, made with the naked fabric, so very brushed and soft to the touch. It has this kind of like low V-neck scoop, but whenever you bend over, I never feel like I'm at a risk of falling out or anything, which is a plus for me. Once you turn to the back, it has a rather low cut, which I like as well, but overall, it's just very comfortable. Definitely a lounging bra for me or a bra that I wear underneath t-shirts to go run errands and whatnot but I would say this is a medium to light or light to medium support on me. Very simple, essential bra to have in all of your closet. Last but not 
not least, this is the Naked Balance bra, and this is definitely my favorite bra out of this entire collection. It's also the first ever one shoulder sports bra that I've ever worn, and I actually wore this for the video that I posted right before this, which is my home gym tour, and it just held up very, very nicely. Super comfortable, and it actually is so flattering. I was afraid that it wouldn't be as flattering because I personally feel like I kind of have a wider chest, even though I have like a smaller frame, if that makes sense. I never liked how one shoulder shirts ever looked on me, but this is so cute and I just love it like this whole fit as a whole I think it's very very cute so yeah anywho so it has these two straps here at the top has this band at the bottom that's very very secure I would definitely say that this is a solid medium support sports bra on me I can bend over without anything falling out none of the girls are showing either but overall it's just a very flattering cut if you turn to the back then the strap actually comes over all the way to the other side. Overall, love it. Has the Paragon Fitwear logo in the back right there. And I just feel very secure in this sports bra. I thought that it was gonna be too big whenever I first took it out of the bag, but it actually fit me true to size. But if I had to pick one sports bra from this entire collection for y'all to pick, it would definitely be the Naked Balance bra because it's just so flattering. Love the cut. It's very different, but still simple and elegant. So. Love it. All right, guys. So that pretty much wraps up everything that I have to show you guys from this collection. But there were a couple pieces that I didn't have that I'll just kind of like put screenshots up here for you guys to see. But there is the high rise naked linear legging with the sculpt seam seam as well. There's the high rise naked short with a three and a half inch inseam and no pocket. I just don't dig any shorts that are less than four and a half inches, to be honest, which is why I chose the high rise pocket short, which is five inches. There's the naked racer back dress, which I'm very interested to see exactly how it fits because in the pictures, it looks really short, but I feel like it would be a really cute summer dress to wear with some sneakers or something, but there is that. It also has a built-in shelf bra, which is honestly like I might just get it just to try it out but there's also the feather knit crop top but I think that's pretty much it of the products that I don't have I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions at all drop a comment down below or DM me on Instagram and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you guys have about this collection launching on August 2nd at 4 p.m. central time and code Tracy does save you 10% off if you want to go ahead and support me while also saving some coin as well but otherwise please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already and if you liked this video go ahead and leave it a like but there is so much content coming so so soon I have been enjoying just kind of like creating content and experimenting with this new camera it's honestly made me so excited to continue creating content for you guys there's just gonna be so many videos coming so soon I'm going to Hawaii next month with Gio for the second time so we're actually going with one of our friends Joy who also lives in Oahu so a summer full of travels and I'm just very very excited but otherwise I will see y'all in the next video, so stay tuned, and I'll see y'all later.